You know, I gotta hand it to Mike. The waitresses here keep getting prettier every time. I'll bet you say that to all of us. I do, but it's still true. <laughs> Thank you. Having a nice day, you sick freak. You are a pig, a selfish, abusive piece of trash. Oh, Sam, I didn't hurt your sister. Are you, oh, it makes me sick to hear you lie. Look, Come Tracy, on. Will you no, tell her do not let him Come play on. you. Tell him you believe Chrissy. It's over with. That's why she drops the charges. Yeah, you love that, don't you? Come on, you promise Christina you let this go. How, how can Christina let this go? It's a small town. She's bound to run into him. Christina has no reason to be afraid of Christina me. will feel sick every time she looks at your face. That's what happens with abuse victims. So don't tell me she doesn't have anything to fear. Right, I don't need to listen to yeah, this. Yeah, go. And do me a favor. If you see her, you look the other way. Okay, well, I didn't get your answer. You think Christina's lying, don't you? I don't want to fight. I just, I honestly can't believe you sided with that guy. Uh, I did not side with Ethan. You refused to say that you thought Christina was telling the truth. That guy deserves to be thrown in prison and you're practically defending no, him. I'm just saying you're too close to this to be a. No, 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 no. Don't okay, do that I'm to me. I'm just saying, Sam, that this is a very emotional issue for you. Yes, it is. You bet it is. My little sister gets the crap beaten out of her and she's so afraid to go to a trial that she has the charges against her attacker dropped. Come to find out, you don't believe her or me. Okay, you trust Christina because you're a loving I sister, and that's- I trust Christina because she's telling the truth. Why don't you get that? Because this goes beyond me believing that Christina's telling the truth. Sonny wants me to take somebody out until there's proof. I don't know what really happened, and neither do you. You threw this. Christina says that Ethan came to her house right after you left and beat her up. But that's not possible because you went to the Hunter's Star no, and you had a fight with Ethan. It doesn't there. matter. She got her timing wrong. She had his skin under her I fingernails. Ethan claims she scratched him when he picked her up to take her to the hospital. Oh, great story. He's got you fooled. Well, I'm just saying that it could be true and you have to take into account that Christina has lied before. Oh, come on. That is so unfair. Yes, every teenage girl occasionally lies. It doesn't mean when they're actually saying something serious, uh, you I, shouldn't believe them. I know, but I'm just saying that we're focused on Ethan. Maybe somebody else is involved here. We you need know what? To I don't want to talk about this anymore. I don't like, feel like I'm getting sick to myself. Okay. Okay, stomach here. okay. Uh, if, just if Christina is lying, it's got to be killing her inside. So if you can just calm down, for now, let Lucky follow up on this, and he's going to find out the truth no, one way or another. Fine, it's fine. If you need that, that's fine. I don't. The truth is what Christina says. That's it. Are you sure that Morgan said nothing about Michael to Dante or to Ronnie? Nothing. And Dante made a point of warning me and Morgan to be careful around him or any cop. Yeah, but you would have warned Morgan anyway. See, Dante's just working everybody at this point. Oh, Dante and Morgan got really close this past year. And how could Dante not adore Morgan? He's a great kid. And Dante made it all the way down to the island and then made a point of not finding Michael. I don't know. Maybe he's protecting his brothers. You wanted full disclosure? You got it. The trial is as good as over, and Sonny is all but convicted. 